Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a huge Dollar Tree store haul. So if you watched my last video and also if you're keeping up with my vlogs or on Snapchat, then you will know that um, I was moving and then I couldn't move. But anyways, I bought a bunch of like new home decor and like just like home necessities. Um, from a couple different places, but the biggest one by far is Dollar Store. So I definitely need to make like a dedicated video solely to that. If you guys want to see the other home decor things that I purchased, let me know down below in the comment section. And then after this video, I will meet you down there. I can save money. I'm all about that. And I also want to help you guys with budgeting and like finding really affordable things because I know firsthand when you move and when you need new things like this, it can add up and be such an expense. So if there's anything that is affordable and awesome quality, I'm definitely going to tell you guys about it. Don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. I put out new videos all the time. And I also have a vlog channel with my boyfriend, Paul. So I will leave that link somewhere here on the screen at the end of the video and in the description box below. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's get into this video. Okay, the first thing are these cute little candle holders. These are so pretty. They had them in other colors, but I got two orange and two green. And I guess this can be used for a multi-purpose. I plan on putting these in my like bathroom cabinet for cotton swabs and like Q-tips and things like that. I love little candle holders and these ones were so pretty and decorative. I picked up a couple of them each. I also picked up um, one, two, three, four of these containers. I actually have a ton of these that I purchased in the past. These square glass jar containers from the Dollar Tree are super like heavy duty, good quality glass. And these have lasted me for years. I use a lot of these for my makeup, for like lipsticks or some nail polishes, um, things like that, brushes. And now I'm going to use some of these in my bathroom and also my kitchen to put like tea bags and stuff in. So these are great for anything that you need. Super affordable, only a dollar. And these are better than some of the jars that I've seen at like Myers or any kind of like store like that. So I've definitely been on the hunt for something to put my olive oil in for the kitchen. So I found this at the dollar store, I was so excited. These are typically a few dollars at the store, and at the dollar store, it was only a dollar. You know you're an adult when you get excited for a liquid glass container. <laughs> Betty, whoops, this is upside down. Betty Cracker scissors, I've needed a new good pair of scissors for a while now, and I was surprised to find Betty Cracker at the dollar store, that's so awesome. Name brands, a dollar only. Another kitchen utensil. This one is actually really cool and I've been meaning to find something like this for a very, very long time. This is like a salad tosser, but I like to use these for picking up spaghetti because otherwise it just like drops everywhere if you just have like the regular spoon, which is what I have. Anyways, this is kind of cool because you can actually detach these, which I didn't know until I was reading it. So, pretty nifty. <laughs> An apple slicer. You cannot go wrong. This can be used for more than just apples. You can do peaches, nectarines, whatever. Like, I am always eating fruit. I love fruit. And if I can save time by just like taking a little peeler and like pushing it down and chopping up all my fruit, then I'm gonna get it. I picked up a ton of kitchen towels. I actually threw up, not really threw out, but I made a lot of my old kitchen towels into like rags because they were just that nasty. So I really needed to pick up some more, but I wasn't looking forward to paying like three, four, or five dollars per towel. These ones are just like the towels that I've seen at like Myers or like Kroger or Walmart or any of those stores, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, whatever. These are only a dollar. These are microfiber. I love this print with the like the blue flowers. So cute. I kind of got this one to match. These are all microfiber, by the way. I also kind of got this one to kind of match. I know sometimes I layer up my towels. I don't know. I'm weird. I'm a girl. Whatever. I also got this really pretty, like, orange floral color. And this one is actually a drying mat. So this is perfect for when I rinse out my smoothie cups. Instead of, like, putting it in the dirty sink, I can put it right here on this drying mat and it'll be clean and ready for the next day of use. I also picked up a huge bag of cotton balls. I was out and I needed some more. Ooh, okay, if you're a girl or you have long hair, you know the struggle. I had to pick up a hair catcher. Paul, you can thank me later. <laughs> also for the shower, I just got a suction cupped um, like soap holder because ours right now is just like sitting on the ledge and it always falls and it's so annoying, so. Picked up a soap catcher. Okay, I have a little story. I went to Myers and I was looking for shower curtains and little like hangers. I picked up a pack of like 12 decorative hangers. They were $8, okay? I went to the dollar store and I found the same exact ones for a dollar. Like, 
Guess who's going back and getting their $7 back? This girl is. These are the same pack of 12, they have the same exact design. The only difference is that the ones that I picked up from Myers have like little like balls on the top, but whatever, no one looks at those anyways. So yeah, a dollar. Like, are you kidding me? About to go get my money back. <laughs> I picked up a lint brush because these are perfect for couches or beds. If you get like hair or lint or like pet hair, these are perfect. And normally these are around like five, ten dollars. So to find them for a dollar is a steal. So I picked up one of these. I cannot tell you how hard it is to find like basic white containers. Like they're the most basic container ever and I could not find them. I went to like four different stores, couldn't find them. But of course I went to the dollar store and they came through and they had exactly what I was looking for. Even better actually. So these are just um, packs of containers. This is a pack of two and this came in a pack of three. These are awesome for using in the bathrooms if you want to organize different things like in your cabinets or in your linen closets or even in like your closets or your kitchen. These are awesome. I also like that they're like semi-transparent so you can kind of get an idea of what's in there instead of having to like take something down from the shelf and like looking through each basket just to find something you're looking for. So these are awesome, I'm excited to use these. I'm so happy I found them. These are awesome to have for anything with hanging up things or lights or pictures or frames or whatever. I was really happy to find these at the dollar store. These are the same as like the command strips or command hooks. They're self-adhesive hooks. There's a pack of nine of them and you just like hook them on the wall and you can hang up whatever you want. These are normally a couple of dollars so I was really happy to find them for just one dollar. So another household thing is Velcro. These are awesome to have for anything that you need it for and to find it at a dollar is awesome. I found this really pretty contact paper. They have a huge selection of a ton of different styles and sizes, but this one was super pretty. I love like white and gray. So contact paper um, is awesome for just like lining shelves or like lining like cabinets just to make it look a little more pretty and to keep things like clean and smooth and make it look like more finished. So they have an awesome selection for contact paper for a dollar. So I picked up this larger bin to put uh, like my cleaning supplies underneath my sink in it just to keep it a little more organized. These bins are awesome for like organization for the bathroom, like your bedroom, kitchen, living room, whatever. You can put literally whatever you need to in here. My receipt's still in here. But anyways, I love bins like this just because they're like so easy just to throw things in there. So you can still like kind of be lazy but still kind of be organized. <laughs> I also got two more of those bins but these ones are a little different because these are more of like a shoebox container. They have the lids and they snap right onto the top. I got two of these. Um, I don't really know what I'm going to put in these just yet, but I'm thinking probably something for the linen closet or in the kitchen. You can, again, use these for literally whatever you want to, just like the other bits I showed. They have reusable cleaning gloves. I use these when I do my dishes and also when I'm cleaning the bathroom, no matter what. I'm always stocking up on these and they're just awesome in general to have. They have different sizes. They even have like different kinds. Okay, this is the last thing I got and it's like really kind of odd. Oh, oh, what is this? I was like, whoa, like what is that when I first seen it? This is a steering wheel cover. Like, that's awesome. In my head, I'm thinking in the wintertime, my steering wheel is always so, so cold because it's leather. I'm like, this cover would make my hands a little warmer. <laughs> So if you're a person that likes steering wheel covers, they have an awesome selection. They actually had a couple different colors. So check out your dollar store if you like these type of things. These are furry, fuzzy, soft, and this lilac color is really pretty. I like it a lot. I can't believe I bought a steering wheel cover. Like, who am I? I don't buy these things, but it's going to keep my hands warm. That's all that matters. <laughs> Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and let me know down in the comment section what your favorite thing to pick up from the dollar store is and if there's other items that I should try. Don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. I will have all my social links at the end of this video and in the down bar. Subscribe if you aren't already. I put out new videos all the time. I think I'm actually going to start getting on a schedule of uploading videos. Um, I'm kind of thinking about it, but if you guys have like a certain day that you prefer to watch videos or any like ideas or suggestions for me, Leave it down in the comment section, and again, after this video, I'll meet you guys down there. Alright, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!